Okay, here I have my assembly instructions and we're going to follow them pretty closely here uh, because the sequence of assembly is pretty important. Um, the only deviation that you might be able to do is you can do the booster stage at the same time you're doing the upper stage. But within the upper stage, follow the sequence and then when you're in the booster stage, follow the sequence there as well. So our first step is we need to remove some parts from the boards. Um, we're going to, we want parts uh, B, C, D, and E. So um, B, C, and E are here on the plywood. We're also going to want this, uh, the eBay sled. This is called the sled. And then we also want part D. Um, so you're going to take your hobby knife. And I recommend cutting through the uh, little tabs so that you can remove the parts easier without damaging them. And this little piece right here um, is also removed and that is scrap so you can just put that aside. Um, okay, now we're going to take, um, we're on step three and we're going to take part E uh, we're going to put it onto the side of the board that has the lettering on it um, and that's going to get glued right here and we want this nice and flat and um, we can either use thin or medium thick um, CA and my glue is going to wait for it to come down to the bottom. Make sure it's nice and straight and nice and flat. And I'm going to take some accelerator, the InstaSet. I'm running low. All right. And that should be good. Um, and now we're on to step four. Um, oops, and step two, <laughs> we got kind of out of order there. Uh, we want to take this piece right here and it gets glued here on the back side of the board right there. And for that, um, I'm going to use thin and I'm just going to wick some CA glue right into that corner. And I'll hit it with uh, the InstaSet. All right, so now on step four, um, we're going to take a ring C, this one right here, and the side with the C faces the board, and we're going to slide it in there like that, and you'll see that this little tab here will go into that little slot right there like that make sure it's nice and flat and then we're going to take some ca and we're going to run it on all the uh, parts where it mates Okay, now we're going to take um, B, which is this piece right here, um, and this is going to go on the bottom side of the board. And what this part does, it, go, it only goes one direction, you can see that. Um, this actually creates a baffle that will run through 
um, the bottom of the eBay. So the uh, the rocket motor is here, and it will the ejection charge will come out of the motor, fill up that little cavity there, then go into that hole there, um, and then on this side it actually um, goes around this way and then back this way. So on this side of the board, the ejection charge comes here on this side. Underneath it goes this way and then it will come back out around that way. So this creates a baffle on the underside of the board, which is a really cool engineering trick. There's so much involved in this little board that I'm, I'm very impressed by how it all fits together and how it all works really nice. All right, so we're going to pause right here and then we're going to start doing the most critical step is gluing on the coupler onto the, uh, the bottom side of the sled right here. Mm -hmm.